Good early morning, everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Is the MLB ready to sc is screwing over another legacy franchise because of the, because of a lawsuit? My thoughts coming right up. Yes, we're back with the show. No, it's not a gameplay, but I promise you, I will. Uh, gameplays will be coming once I'm done with the current film playthroughs. Once all the NCAA stuff is taken care of, including the NCAA football ones. So let's go with that. And uh, though I missed, I'll be right back. Yes, because well, let's talk about this. Yes, let's talk about this. Well. A few days ago, it was revealed that the pro business pro business girl of Atlanta, mostly a conservative group, is suing Major League Baseball for one billion dollars because MLB pulled the All Star Game from Atlanta, which personally I believe is sh what sh probably honestly it should have. Do I agree with the decision? Yeah, but honestly, they could have pulled. They could have just said they could have pulled the COVID card like they did for LA, and this lawsuit probably would have still happened. And the All Star game this year is in happens to be in Coors Field, which honestly not a bad location. But now Denver is in the middle of a co this controversy because this lawsuit is going to tell Denver, sorry, we want it back, please. Take the L. Here's the thing. Denver, in my eyes, Denver is probably one of the last places I wanted to see this. Well, this all, if they're going to honor Hank Aaron, it should have been in Milwaukee. And no, I am not calling it. By that name. It's still Miller Park, damn it. So, yeah. Coors Field. And besides, what happens if Coors Field... What happens if, it, if Denver gives in? And gives in. They're going to go through the same issues that the, the Atlanta loss is bringing up. And also... And also, Denver is relatively... Ah, uh, never mind. But what's interesting is, who's hosting the All-Star Game next year? Yep, Dodger Stadium. Do the Dodgers are hosting it. And honestly, I don't think this is going to happen. And it, But I, it's a possibility they're going to try it. But it's extremely unlikely this pro-business Atlanta group could potentially protest in front of Dodger Stadium to convince the Dodgers to give up their All-Star Game slot in 2022. And the only way I can see this work is if the Atlanta gives financial compensation to LA, but oh, wait. LA is hosting the Super Bowl next year. And honestly, if it wasn't for COVID, I would have said this is really not fair that LA is hosting both the Super Bowl and the MLB All-Star Game. In the same year, but COVID pretty much screwed the Dodgers once. And if Manfred tries and screws the Dodgers out of another All Star game, I'm pretty sure the ownership group will tell Manfred to stand to step down and resign and let someone else take over. Because you do not screw a legacy franchise like the Dodgers. And let me put it to you this way. And Boy, that's a shitty name for a field. No Depot. I don't know what they are. Oh, getting off topic. Like, you don't screw a legacy fran franchise like the Dodgers. If you try to screw over those damn Yankees, those y Yankee fans would want, would ask for Manfred's head on a head on a pike. I'm dead serious. And honestly. I know Yankee fans and Dodger fans are pissed off at a certain group that Manfred dropped the ball with. Ahem. Ahem. But realistically, I don't see the Dodgers 
giving it up manually unless Atlanta gives them financial compensation. But let's be honest, we all know where this is going. That financial compensation that could help get more more renovations for Dodger Stadium, including possibly stat a statue for Vince Scully, Tommy and Lasorda, and all the great Dodgers in the Ring of Honor. No, I'm not talking about the wrestling company. But we all know where this is going. Th that funds that were supposed to go to Dodger Stadium instead will go to to support the recall for Governor Newsom. And I'm not going to say it's not what's probably what's going to happen because some people in the GOP are really shitty people. I said some, not all. Let's get that out of our system, people. So, yeah. I, for Atlanta, I am sorry. I'm sorry to say this, but expect this lawsuit to be dropped. But I do think this beautiful ballpark, Dress Park, will host the All-Star Games. Let's say 2026. I know that seems harsh, but this is this is MLB. They're probably gonna do something stupid. I mean, I mean, I mean, who else are they thinking about hosting the All Star Game? The fucking Marlins. Oops, forgot 2017 back when it was Marlins Park. Let's see who else. No, not in that shithole of a stadium. No, no, not in that bigger shithole of a stadium. Well, maybe. They just had it. That could very well happen. That, that will get, this will get my vote. Alright, thanks for watching everyone.